Good afternoon, guys. I am currently sitting in my doctor's office, and I'm waiting to see my ear doctor to get my ears checked because I kind of need them cleaned out. Uh, but the biggest reason why I'm here, and I'm so excited and nervous at the same time, is I'm getting hearing aids today, new hearing aids. I haven't had new hearing aids in at least 10 years. So that's kind of hard because... I'm so used to the quality. Hi, Dr. Sheep. Oh, last time, and then it was like a total fail. <laughs> she couldn't post it. Oh, oh no, this is exciting. I want to document getting. I think, I honestly believe the last time I got these, um, they were sponsored by the Department of Rehab. And I honestly want to say it's been at least 10 years. Oh, yeah, those are old. <laughs> but they're workhorses. Those things they are work not. fine. It's like I mean, a Cadillac. You needed to test them right now. Those things are fine. But if I can get new ones, I should. But you're, yeah, it's, you know, you're due for an upgrade. It, it's worth it to try these. If not, we can get you a and newer version of that. And then the maintenance of, of them, I could just come to you for it? Yeah, so you've got your maintenance included um, through your Medi-Cal. Okay. Yeah, but you can do a lot of this on your own. So that's the thing too, it, this was covered by Medi-Cal, not Medicare. Right? Not Medicare, no. Medi-Cal. Yeah. Because they cover every 10 years, you said? Five years. Five, oh yeah, I'm way over Medi-Cal does? For hearing aids. Mm -hmm. They never did before. That's crazy, because we ran into that dude at Home Depot, remember? Yeah. They never, how, when did they start covering hearing aids? Not every plan does, yeah. but the ones that do, I mean, they've been doing that for years. They did when I, they did when I was a child. Yeah. And then when I got, eight, when I turned 18, they stopped. It's changed again now where yeah. they're, like, you still have kind of the standard Medi-Cal. Uh-huh. And that's, that's pretty good coverage, but they've changed to, like, HMOs type, right. you know, so there's differences and I, now. Uh, when all that happened, I called them and I said, I want to stay Medi-Medi. Yeah, that's good. That's good that you're able to. Because you can you can come here instead of being yeah, seen in orange. Yeah, that would be here. If not, then it would limit who I see. And I right. Like, I just seen Dr. Chief since I was five years old. I'm not about to change that. She goes now. to USC for her regular positions. I hear wind in the background. Yeah. That's this wind. Mm -hmm. That's your air conditioner above you. How's my voice sound? Muffled. Muffled. Yeah. Everything sounds very muffled right now. There's no way that you could compare what I'm hearing from this. No, there, there, and I can listen to them, and I can, yeah. I can tell. But there's only so much I'm going to be able to change. One of the limits with the plan is that we are restricted to a certain level of hearing aids, so they're not that, you know, adjustable. I can't really tweak them as, you know, to make them sound like another hearing aid. Mm -hmm. Exactly, and they're two totally different companies. Yeah. I think our best bet, Alicia, is going to be. Let's replace them with an upgraded Phonak, something mm -hmm. that you're already sort of used to, because mm -hmm. that, you know, you stay in the same family, it'll be more familiar, yeah. and you've done so well with that. Yeah. So today I'm just going to, I'm going to take those back, we're going to take ear impressions, we're going to get new molds made. I'm going to try to keep them small, mm -hmm. if possible, but we're going to stick with the standard tube and get you a nice strong hearing aid again. Okay, because this is the receiver in the canals. This that's is the loudest it would go? That's as loud as that's I absolutely, go. like, it's giving me anxiety. If it's I too dead for you. I don't like it at all. It's Why? Because it it's new? It sounds muffled. It sound, this side sounds muffled. Mm -hmm. um, and, like, the whatever noise is going on over there, like, kind of blocked off the noise right now. Okay. It sounds like there's an air conditioner. And yeah, this but side on sounds that. like I... But there is an air conditioner going on right now. No, I know, but it sounds like it's in my ear. I yeah, know, it's pretty Just loud. Just on the right side. Just on the right side. Oh, okay. Um, that's the loudest it goes. I don't like it at all. Like, it's worse than the last time. Listen to this. So here's stronger. Oh, your last time I turned it up, actually. So here's louder. I don't know. No, now I feel like I have a microphone yeah. in my ear. Yeah. It's not going to help if I make it louder. It's just going to be. And the back, the, yeah. That's just going to get stronger yeah, too. Yeah, it did. So. Only on the right side, right? Let me try something. And then this 
is going to take away a little bit of what we want to keep. Is the air conditioner better there? No. You still hear that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think that's, and this is what I was worried sorry. about. Sorry. No, don't be sorry. We needed to try, and we did, and now we know. So we'll do something like, else. Like, it's not even powerful enough on the left side at all. I'm just being I know. It. I know. It's not. Like, these feel like they're, they, what I hear with these, what the sound quality I hear, even though they're older than the heels, um, I feel like I just have hearing, like I can hear as a normal like person. Like normally, right. Yeah. Like I don't feel like feel I have a hearing aid in my ear amplifying noises around You don't think, it. you don't think it's just because you're just so used to that already? No, they are, it's a different Sound. It's a quality issue. I mean, it's, it's a way different quality sound. Yeah, I would never know. I'm just so this is basically, you, you had the same complaint with the first one. Uh, we just got you the stronger speaker. We were hoping to kind of overcome it, but it's not making Not it at all. It so. literally feels like they're pillows over my head, right. over my ears. Let's, uh, I don't like them let's at all. quit while we're ahead. I'm going to mute them out. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry, please. We're going to try whatever we and need to I'm, do. I mean, I've had hearing aids since I was, my first pair was one years old. Okay, so <laughs> now I'm going to get ear molds. The hearing aids weren't a good fit for my hearing loss. It felt like I had pillows over my ears. It was very uncomfortable, the sound quality. Even though she got me the best quality hearing aid for sound, for my hearing loss, it just did it wasn't a good fit. So now we're gonna take send it back and go with a different brand. The brand that I'm used to having, Bonnets, I believe. They're really good. They're super tiny, the new ones, but they don't work. You can't hear what he's saying because I don't have my hearing aids on. But she, <laughs> she loves the Cadillacs. Can I show them? Yeah. The what? So, so these are Alicia's oh. old ones. These were the ones we and attempted. And these are the ones we yeah, attempted. Yeah, they're a bit different, but very they're small. nice. They're, they're like super nice. She wanted me to a have quarter of the a size. modern hearing aid, but... No, she's putting the ear mold in. So now I'm getting paired up on the ear molds. Oh, have you ever seen me get ear molds? No. Been doing this since I was... As far back as I can remember. Go there. Get out! <laughs> That's why she don't like me filming. <laughs> so basically, put some cotton in there with a tube to pull it out. Okay, you can sit down. Hey, trying to get all professional with it. She gonna. She, you're gonna edit a lot of this out. <laughs> Just make me look skinny. We'll be good. I am. It's a trip being on the microphone. It's not on the mic. Uh, this canal is super small. Yeah. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Doctor, she has talked about opening it up, but. If they you could open up that canal. ear canal? Because this ear canal is huge. No way. That's crazy. She's been doing all right so far, so. Mm, why change it? You don't need to be so drastic. Mm -hmm. okay. All right, now I'm going to plug you up. Okay. I won't move. Dude, she took a glue gun, put it in her ear, and it inserted it into her ear. This is awesome. Okay. 
can delete a lot of this footage, but that is cool. This is interesting. This needs to make the vlog. We'll give that a few minutes to kind of settle. And we'll take it out and we'll have a cast of her ears. Yes. Uh, let me work on retubing her old ones. <laughs> the audiologist told me I'm slacking on my job. Hold on. Okay, so here is what it looks like after it's. That's the impression of the ear. Just to send it off for them to make them, so they're not going to be that big. That's the other one. They just, I don't even know how they make them, but. Yeah. I don't even know how they. Really, they're like, that big, and they, they turn lot. into something then they're gonna like, look that like that this. at the end of it. Just, now she has to cut the tube, measure the tube. It's interesting because you. I mean, I've been doing this my whole life, so I know the process, but you've never seen it be done. Because when we lived down here, before I worked days, so I... I can not hear you, Marcus. Oh. This guy keeps talking to me and doesn't <laughs> realize I'm practically deaf without my hearing aids. Hold on, let's get plugged in. I treat her normally. Don't talk to me. She's not handicapped at all. She's, not. <sighs> She's expected to keep up. I can't hear a word they're saying, honestly. So the year needs run over, but I'm excited to wait it out and see the new ones. I think the new ones will be a third time's a charm, right? Oh, yes. So clean. Mm -hmm. So nice. Were you impressed by what just happened? <laughs> it was cool to watch. This one? We're at Costco. We were at so many other interesting places and stuff <laughs> at Costco. I am because I'm tired right now. We're at Costco. Oh, the guy with the water theme here? Fuck, oh, stop looking. <laughs> Shit, all up in the fucking business. People are nosy, man. What are we gonna do? Um, no, we did go to a lot of places after we, after, after my appointment, we went and ate at one of our favorite, favorite old, time favorite Italian restaurant. Uh, we had pizza and antipasto salad, or antipasto salad, whatever it's called. Uh, but I was starving, he was hungry, so we didn't bust out the camera because we were just too hungry. And then after that, what do we do after we eat? After we ate, it took like, oh, this is a nice pineapple. Pineapples! My safe word, okay? The safe word. This is all we're getting. This guy drink a gallon of water every day. No, I've been meaning to tell you. You need to write down on each line how much you're supposed to drink. Like throughout the day, you start off your day. You start off oh, with no, the bottle I and how much. That within 10 hours. Okay, but you don't always finish the bottle. Yeah, that's good because I've drank like two, three bottles at home already. Kind of think if yeah, we yeah. had anything else. She wants the mango. Is that the you don't want the mango? I do. But she can't eat the mango. She can't lick the mango. It's dirty. You can't. Why I can't. can't. Why can't you? Yeah, Marcus is getting the two fruits that I'm allergic to. Legit. I'm allergic to mango and pineapple. And he's getting the two fruits to eat for his lunch throughout the week, and I'm allergic to both. Thanks. What a supporting, loving husband you are. That's Those all. two items are mine. <laughs> and what does Auntie Fee say? It's fat for people, fat people and kids. And kids love the cheese. So Where else did we go? It's Mama Patrols. It just took forever to get back to Orange County. Oh, we stopped at Walgreens, one of my favorite places to go. <laughs> yeah, I had like, I had like, Five prescriptions ready. She needed her birth control. Oh yeah, we did. We needed time to change it out. Um, yeah. I'm gonna let you guys go. I'm tired. Hey guys, I am now home and I'm going to iron a bit. And then we just unloaded all of our groceries and 
divided up all of our meats and froze stuff. So I am so tired. My body is just done. I basically was going and going and going all week. Had very long days all week and weekend. So I'm just exhausted today. So I'm going to end today's vlog. Um, today's highlight of the day was Marcus being able to go with me to watch, see how the process is done to the hearing aids and for the fitting for the hearing aids because he's never been able to see me get that done and um, all these years I've been doing it, I've always gone by myself and I just thought that was really awesome that he was able to, able to experience that with me because if you're not, if you've never worn hearing aids or you don't know anyone that does, then you don't know what goes into being able to wear them because they have to be fit, fitted to your ears. Um, and also, you know, they have to alter the hearing aid so that it matches your hearing loss. So I thought that was a really awesome experience that he was able to go with me and um, yeah, I'm not disappointed at all. Uh, she did a couple little, like, repairs on the hearing aids I have right now, and so right now I hear great. I feel fine, and I'm hearing just fine with them. So we'll see what happens, but I just thought that it would be interesting to show you guys a little, you know, part of my life and things that I've been... It's just something that I'm so used to because I've been getting hearing aids since... I believe I was like, I don't know, one, three years old, like, I've been, it's been my whole life, so, um, yeah, it was really interesting, and it was a good day, it's been a really good day, I've been able to spend time with Marcus, and now I'm tired, so we're going to spend time watching movies together, I think we're going to finally watch the last episode of Orange is the New Black, yeah, we're that behind. Please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe if you are new to my channel. That way we can become YouTube friends and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys, have a blessed day.